if we're dealing with an ordinary citizen that's having a problem, absolutely. There is no need for aggression. When you're dealing with a mope trying to dump water over your head, or worse, you have to go in seriously and give that message. We cannot look at it as an isolated situation. So it's easy to take this legislation and say, well, why would we do that? Let's look at all the other pieces of legislation that have passed that soften the police, or police department to a point where we're not effective on the street. They're asking police officers just to walk away and take it. Well, I'm a kid from Queens. In your neighborhood, would you just walk away and take it when someone dumped a bucket of water on your head? Or would you call the police? So now you call the police, should we just walk away and take it? If the politicians that say it's okay, that say we shouldn't have this legislation, had a bucket of water dumped over their head, what would they do? I have the answer. They would call their connections, they'd call the brass in the NYPD. And you know what they'd get? They'd get a response. They'd expect a response. Well, the kids from Queens, the cops in all our boroughs, boroughs, we expect a response too. Common sense says you don't dump a bucket of anything on a police officer responding to an emergency call. And I say this, how dare you expect New York City police, officer, uh, police officers to accept what you won't accept. We're out there doing a job. We do it well. We are the most restrained police department in the country. That's not just a throwaway line. 